Good night, you two. Good night. Good night. Frankie. Frankie. Yeah? Can you tell me the story again? <sighs> Maverick, not tonight. Please. Fine. We have to go to sleep when I'm finished. Okay. When the earth was still in the form of Pangea, there were two worlds. One in the northern mountains that was ruled by man, and one along the southern coast that was ruled by woman. Although Evelyn has support from her father, she struggles under the oppression in the northern society. Meanwhile, Ariel doesn't feel like he belongs off the southern coast. Separated by an unpredictable wilderness and mysterious beasts, these two civilizations have never met or known the other to exist until now. You see, Evelyn and Ariel are connected, yet they don't know how or why. Guess what? What? In two worlds. The only time they used to see each other is when they walk into the fire in vulnerability. As they learn how to thrive in a gender-dominated society and gain understanding about nature versus nurture, self-awareness and self-esteem, they find out what true acceptance and rejection and what love and loss really means. Yet it's their belief in something so far-fetched, so crazy, that keeps them searching for the truth in each other. In the end, it will take a leap of faith as the world goes through a destructive rebirthing process to rise out of the ashes, through the dirt, this time, side by side, starting again. Are you ready to take a leap of faith with us?